I was on the phone to my boyfriend. I'm like, ah, the mother's in my room. And then got my pajama top and was like, ah, ah. So I haven't been nervous before the show this festival, but I have had some pretty sweet depression. So don't worry, I'm not getting away from it. It very much varies, because um, sometimes I feel terrible and then I do a show and the adrenaline and the focus of being, like your focus changes so it stops being all the negative thoughts going around and around in a circle and you get on stage and you have to make people laugh so sometimes having an objective helps. But then other times she is very loud and very strong and, um, and sometimes you can't focus on the audience. Um, basically, I love thinking about myself is what I'm saying. I don't know, you just got to keep writing jokes until people are comfortable with it. And so I just kept writing jokes and if people wouldn't laugh, I'd just write more and more jokes about it. And so by about 10 minutes in, they go, oh, well, this is the show and we better just get, like, chill out with it. IBS can be a very big inconvenience. What is frustrating is my venue has one lady's toilet and that is for the, um, the punters and for the acts and for the crew. So sometimes I'm like, I'll just do a little, a little panic wee just before the show, just go in there. And I'm like, huh, huh, excuse me, excuse me. And they're like, I'll be out in a second. I'm like, I've got to go, I've got to go on stage. Excuse me. I don't actually say that. In my head, that's what I'm saying. What I stand, do is I stand there and go, I'm afraid of moths and I don't know why uh, we have a massive moth in our house it's huge I had to kill one the other night I've, he's got mates he keeps bringing them over and then last night I was in the lounge room and was just watching TV and uh, there was a moth just like banging at the window like I'll get you I'm fine with snakes, fine with spiders, but for some reason, big powdery bats, unpredictable. I don't drink or take drugs. Uh, I haven't smoked this week. So, this sounds so daggy. Dancing is kind of the thing that, it's not like my drug or anything, but it's the thing where I can lose myself. And uh, so I, I, I DJ a couple of times during the festival and that's where I get to wear a ridiculous outfit and dance around and play whatever music I want and I don't care if they don't like it. And last year, uh, it was like the second last night and I played Mariah Carey's All I Want For Christmas Is You and held up a sign that said, I don't give a fuck mate. Yeah, any rumors about myself? <laughs> They're usually good ones that aren't true. <laughs> They're like, oh, I heard you signed with this agent. I'm like, no, no. Um, or, oh, like I just assumed that you sell out every night in Edinburgh. I'm like, yes, I sell out every night. I just let people believe that. So book tickets early because I sell out every night. <laughs>